you are welcome to series 2 of our previous video. I believe you have taken your time to do the necessary personal preparations and findings mentioned in the series 1 of this video, which is the pre-investment. I believe you have concluded on the property that best fits your status and you have been able to get in communication with the seller. My name is Omotayo Patrick. I am a real estate entrepreneur. In this video, I will explain those things you should make sure it's in place before finalizing the investment process. Now, back to the business of the day. Here are what you should do during investing in real estate. Number one, do your due diligence. I am pretty sure you have heard this many times. Carrying out due diligence when you want to buy real estate, mostly in Africa and especially in Nigeria. Get the necessary documents verified before commitment. Make sure you are not buying acquisition land and always find out the right or the real owner of the property. Most importantly, you have to ask questions around the community because some properties are on sales because the said owner is losing the property to either government or other circumstances and they want to cash out whatever they could get out of the property. Mind you, they can only sell to lazy buyers or investors that won't do is or our due diligence. You can watch this video here about the critical questions to ask before buying properties. If this is your first time on my channel, I am trying to hit the 1000 subscriber target and I would appreciate it if you could be a part of making the dream come true. Please click on the subscribe button. Thank you. Number two, don't allow your emotions. We are trying to discuss real estate investment here and not where you want to live because most of the time people listening to their heart buying a home more than thinking about it logically. You can be emotionally attached to a property only if it is a place you will be living for many years of your life. So do not let your emotion affect your decision when buying an investment property. Think of it as purely a business investment and logically negotiate to get the best possible price. With the above mentioned tips, you are good to go. If you have not watched the other series of this video, click series 1 and make sure you subscribe if you have not done that. Please like, comment and share. Thank you until I come your way again.